Hello. Digital product passports offer a method to track products through their entire life cycle. These passports document all aspects of the life cycle, from the sourcing of raw materials to final disposal and or recycling. For businesses, DPPs are becoming essential to comply with best practice guidance, as well as coming statutory regulations that demand, tr that demand transparency in supply chains. Consumers are also requiring increased visibility into how products are produced, transported, and retired. As a result, DPPs are emerging as a straightforward, common-sense solution for meeting these needs efficiently. So what components comprise a digital product passport? Well, first up, data collection. Accurate data is critical to the success of any digital product passport. Information must be collected at each stage of a product's life, including material sourcing, energy use, and environmental impact. Consistent, trusted data ensures the DPP reflects the true life cycle of the product. Errors or missing information can weaken the effectiveness of the passport itself. Therefore, businesses need reliable and robust systems to capture and maintain this data. Next, blockchain. Blockchain, of course, is a secure method for storing data collected by digital product passports. It provides a decentralized platform where once data is recorded, it cannot be changed. This makes it easier for businesses to ensure the accuracy and integrity of their product information. Blockchain can also build trust in the supply chain as all channel stakeholders can verify the same data. This approach reduces the risk of disputes over product origins and production processes. Next up, IoT, the Internet of Things. IoT's real-time tracking of products as they move through the supply chain allows data gathering on attributes such as temperature, location, or condition, all of which are automatically added to the digital product passport. This is especially useful for industries where precise conditions must be monitored, such as in the food or pharmaceutical industry. These IoT systems help businesses maintain near real-time information on their products. It also supports better decision-making by providing immediate access to critical data. Of course, AI, artificial intelligence. Artificial intelligence helps process and analyze the large amounts of data generated by digital product passports. AI and machine learning tools identify patterns, predict issues, and suggest ways to optimize operations. This enhances efficiency by automating data management tasks and providing insights that would be difficult to achieve manually. Businesses can use AI to make faster, more informed decisions about their supply chains. Overall, AI ensures that digital product passports are not just a fixed record, but an active tool for improving performance. Regulatory compliance. Governments, including the EU, are beginning to require companies to be increasingly more transparent about their products' environmental and social impact Digital product passports assist these businesses to meet these regulatory requirements by providing a detailed and verifiable record of the product's life cycle. This can reduce the risk of non-compliance fines or other penalties. Having a well-documented digital product passport also makes it easier to report to regulators and stakeholders. Compliance becomes much more efficient as organizations can expeditiously provide the required information when needed. So why do digital prospect passports actually matter? Well, consumers today expect transparency about the products they purchase. They want to know how the product is made, where the materials come from, and what happens after the product is used. DPPs quickly and easily allow organizations to provide this information in a clear and reliable way. And in addition to meeting that consumer demand, they make it easier for companies to track the various components of their supply chains. This level of visibility helps improve operations while building trust with customers. There are some challenges. 
Setting up a digital product passport system requires a significant investment in technology, including blockchain, IoT devices, and AI tools. This can be a major financial hurdle, especially for smaller companies with limited resources. Managing the large volume of data required by digital product passports is another significant challenge. Businesses do need systems in place to ensure the data is truly accurate and up to date. If proper oversight and management is neglected, the benefits of digital product passports can become diminished and the system may not function as well as expected. Despite these challenges, the advantages of digital product passports are clear and significant. They help companies comply with regulations, improve supply chain transparency, and build trust with consumers. As the technology becomes more affordable and accessible, more businesses will be embracing digital product passports. Early adopters are already seeing the positive effects on their operations, and over time, digital product passports may well become a standard tool for companies looking to stay competitive in a market that increasingly values transparency.